Some people have described this as a border surge. I mean, the fact is that we are investing resources in securing our border that have never been invested before, a doubling, again, of the Border Patrol, $3.2 billion worth of a technology that we took from the chief of the Border Patrol, the technology that he needs to have 100% awareness and to secure our border. Dealing with the exit, exit program, dealing with E-Verify, so that all of these things are in place. But I do think the American people have asked us if we pass an immigration bill off the Senate floor to do everything that we can to ensure that we have secured the border. That's what people in Tennessee have asked for. That's what people in North Dakota have asked for. That's what people in Arizona have asked for. And Madam President, I think that's what this amendment does. I want to thank all involved in crafting an amendment that I think tries to deal with the sensibilities on both sides and at the same time secure our border in such a way that we can put this issue mostly behind us and we can have an immigration system in our country that meets the needs of a growing economy, the biggest economy in the world, that focuses on making our country stronger, not weaker, and hopefully we'll put this debate behind us. And so